Hello everyone, my name is Olga and I'm one of the founders of Golden Fay Cosmetics, a truly natural skincare brand. Not too long ago, I was at the mall and a young lady at one of the kiosks tried to sell me a skincare product she claimed was 100% natural and organic. Of course, I'm always interested in finding truly natural products, so I looked at the ingredients of the product she was offering. And as usual, I was um, disappointed because it was 99% chemical and she actually had no idea what natural really meant. And since this happens all over the place, I decided to do a video on how to tell if your skincare product is actually natural or if it's a fake natural. Natural oils and herbs have a very mild smell to them. So if your product smells perfumey, most likely it has synthetic fragrance in it. Many times dangerous preservatives are labeled as fragrance since they possess what's called an aromatic ring and smell really good. Everything natural is so colorful. Nature is an amazing artist, but she rarely paints with color white. Even these little seemingly white flowers are actually cream and yellow. If your moisturizer is mostly white, there's very, very little natural there, if at all. Take a look. Here's some glycerin. And as you can see, it is completely transparent. Absolutely transparent. And now here is some silicone and I don't know if you can see or not, but it's also pretty much completely transparent and liquid. So when you are using um, silicone and glycerin and water as your main ingredients for a moisturizer, you will end up with a product that looks similar to this. It's colorless, but sometimes they add yellow or pink. Large cosmetic manufacturers like using these ingredients because they're so inexpensive. And even if your product lists glycerin as vegetable or organic, it's still a very strong alcohol, much stronger than regular alcohol that's made from potatoes, which is vodka. So take a look, vodka is also an alcohol, just like glycerin, and they look so similar, both colorless, transparent alcohol liquids, so we can definitely tell that even though vodka is made from potatoes, it's definitely not potato salad, it's not natural. So glycerin made of vegetables is definitely not a vegetable, it's obviously an alcohol, a synthetic product. Everyone knows that in large quantities, alcohols are very dangerous to your health. And as all alcohols, glycerin is drying and is bad for your liver. Of course, you won't see these issues right away, but think about how much alcohol in the form of glycerin you absorb through your skin, through your products, every single day for years. When we see water listed on the ingredient panel, we immediately think, oh, it's very moisturizing. But what can a little jar of lotion do for us if gallons of water in the shower did not help us with our dryness? Quite the opposite. It's a paradox, but my skin feels the driest right after the shower. Water is a source of life, but think about water getting into the basement of your house. You know that dangerous mold will be there as a result. But a water-based moisturizer has to sit on the shelf of the store for at least three years and it has to stay looking like this. This is why water, juice, and tea-based moisturizers contain many, many chemical preservatives. These preservatives are there to kill bacteria, which means they can also kill or damage your cells. Your cells are very similar to bacteria and preservatives don't care what they kill. Of course, we think that preservatives are added in such tiny amounts that they cannot possibly harm anything. But think about medication, for example. Here's a pill for blood pressure. It is so small, but it lowers blood pressure in my whole body for 24 hours. Here is how much preservatives you have in one spoon of moisturizer. It's three of those. Do you think it's a lot? I think so. So, to summarize, if your product contains water, tea, or juice as the first or second ingredient, it is impossible for it to be preservative free, and therefore your product cannot be natural. Water is great for our skin when it comes from the inside out, but it's bad news in your moisturizer. It is usually added because it is the cheapest way to make a product, not because it actually delivers moisture to your skin. This is why we here at Golden Fay make products that contain only natural oils and herbs, and they look like this. They deliver true moisture your skin lacks and craves. 
Your skin needs lipids to look its best and the oils are all about that. We use no water and therefore no preservatives. We are so careful about what we eat today. A lot of people try to eat organic. We all try to stay healthy and live longer. So let's also pay attention to what we put on our skin. Always read the ingredients on the ingredient panel to find out the truth about the product you're purchasing. If you see an ingredient you cannot pronounce or you know you cannot eat, don't put it on your skin for your body to absorb. Thank you for watching and please subscribe to our channel for more information on natural healthy lifestyle.